dressed in PPE. Officials from Northern Ireland's Department of Agriculture at a Silver Hill duck breeding facility in Ochnacloy, County Tyrone today. A call of more than 20,000 ducks will take place here in the coming days after a suspected case of the highly pathogenic bird flu was detected. The ducks at this facility here are parent stock. They lay the eggs that later go on to be the ducks that are bought by consumers. It's understood that no ducks here became sick, but that the authorities were alerted following a drop-off in the number of eggs laid here at the weekend. There's now tighter controls on the biosecurity and movement of poultry in this area, pending further testing. Bird flu is spread by migratory wild birds, but can cause serious illness and death if it spreads to commercial flocks. The poultry industry in Northern Ireland and in, in that area of Tyrone is huge. And uh, if it's contained, uh, they'll, they'll roll with it and move on, but, but it has to be contained. The, the potential of not containing it is frightening. This case follows the call of 140,000 commercial poultry across the border in Monaghan in recent weeks. The avian flu season runs from October to March and we've had three outbreaks so far this year in the Republic and one in Northern Ireland. Last year we were fortunate there was only one outbreak in a relatively small turkey flock. But it's a matter of great concern to poultry farmers. It's devastating where it happens and we have all possible precautions in place. The risk to humans is very low, but people are advised not to handle sick or dead wild birds. And there's no evidence of any risk from eating properly cooked poultry. Laura Hogan, RTE News.